WTOC update as construction crews continue their work to renovate Tybee Island City Hall. Now it's something city leaders say will take a lot more patience. I want to show you some photos that were taken right before Christmas as the work continues. Now the building is a designated historic site and part of a timeline account for efforts to preserve historic elements. Mariah Kinjita has the latest on how long this will all take. Demo is still underway, but Assistant City Manager Michelle Owen says they are ahead of schedule. She says they hope to have it done in less than two years. She says it's been an interesting process because they found a few surprises along the way, including one behind a wall. Since October of 2022, City Hall has been closed as crews work on its much needed $1.5 million upgrades. While in the process, Owen says they found things that weren't in their original plan. She says crews found 14 foot ceilings that were buried under layers of drop ceiling, so the ceilings will now be higher than planned. Owen says they also uncovered the hall's original hardwood floors under layers of old flooring and carpet. She says they will preserve these as best they can. And lastly, they found this painting that they hope to restore and display. We discovered an old mural that was painted on the wall ages and ages ago by a former um, Tybee resident. And unfortunately, although the entire mural cannot be restored, you know, we are going to take precautions to leave as much of it in place as it is and perhaps get sections of it and frame it so that we can still have some part of the past. Once the renovations are done inside, they will move on to phase two. Owen says this includes fresh landscaping around the building. On Tybee Island, Mariah Congito, WTOC News.